Hello everyone, this is Maher. Today's workout is going to be targeting our core area, but in a bit explosive way. So stay tuned and let's see what we need to do today. Our mountain climber. Then we could rest for 30 seconds, one minute, up to you, based on your performance. We start with mountain climbers first. Get ready, set your timer. It's one minute or 30 seconds. Let's start with a set 30 second. Rest for 20 seconds, 30 seconds, up to you, as based on your ability. Then after that we will do Superman Plank. We will raise one arm along with the opposite left leg, for example, right arm and left leg. We start with this, we raise one leg, opposite arm, We will do now, after the rest, we will do mountain climbers also for 30 seconds. Then after that, we will do the plank superman or superman plank for the opposite arm and leg. You can take a sip of water. Meanwhile, get ready. Now you will do the Superman plank with the other arm and the other, the opposite leg. Like. Your workout is complete. That is the end of circuit one. We will rest for one minute and then move on to circuit two. So stay on. In circuit number two, we will do two exercises as well. The first exercise is ab rollout. Number two is going to be side plank crunches. So let's get started with these two exercises. First, grab your roll out. Add some rotation. Go straight, but add some rotation. Turns left and right. Get ready for the side plank crunches. Take this position like that. You will initiate the move from your hips. So you will raise your hips like that. You can keep your other hand on your head. So it gives you better momentum when you want to initiate the move. All the way up and all the way down. Go. Get started. Up, down. All the way up, all the way down. Remember to initiate the move from your hips. Your, your glutes are squeezed while you do this exercise. Up, down, all the way up, all the way down. All the way up, all the way down. Up, down, up, rest, down. Now rest. And then we will do the same exercise 
in the same way. Remember, when you do this exercise, you need to keep your arms straight. Do not bend them like that because in this case, you are going to initiate the move from your triceps. And this is not what we need to do. We need to initiate the move from our abs. We need to activate the abs, the core, not the biceps and triceps. So we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We will do now the side plank crunches, but on the other side. So let's take the position. Lying like that. Your arm is straight. The other arm on your head to give you more momentum when you want to use your trunk. So push your hips all the way up, all the way down. Remember, what is moving now is your hip. All the way up, all the way down. Up, down. Congratulations, your workout is complete. Exactly, congratulations because the second two is completed now. We will rest for one minute and then jump in to group three or circuit three. And now for the last circuit, we're going to perform two exercises. The first one is alpine mount climbers, right and left. And then we're going to do cliffhangers plank. Okay, so the two exercises are going to be targeting the same area of the core, but in a very smart way. So let's get started. Take the position of the plank, which is like that, and then it needs your flexibility. Like that, like that. Right, left, right, left, right, left. You need here to perform this exercise with hip flexibility. So if you are a beginner, you can do it like this, and then this this and this. Intermediate or advanced, you could do it like that. Rest. Rest now for 30 seconds. And then get ready for the cliffhangers plank. For this exercise, you need also to take the position of the plank, but you need to extend your arms over your head. You need also to keep your core away from dragging to the floor. So you feel that the power is coming now from your toes and your fingertips plus your core. Stay there. Good. Alpine mountain climbers, get ready. Three, two, go. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. So let's do it without the mat. Extend your arms. Now your body is carried and lifted by your fingertips and your toes, tip toes. So Good. 
congratulations. Your workout is complete. Now, after this exercise, we have finished targeting our core in a burst explosive way. Thank you for doing this exercise. Tomorrow is going to be a different workout targeting another area. So stay tuned. Bye.